Oh my gosh, long time no see. Things here at St. Olga are going mad like ever, but I don't give up. I totally rule this place. Hey girl, what's up? You look different. Is anything wrong there? Did the earth tur- Uh, Marco upset you? Actually, I'm not on earth anymore. Star! Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Star? Listen, Marco. These nachos are evil and they took control of my brain. Trust me, I'm one of them now. What? Wasn't it credible as an excuse? I think... I have a thing with Jackie! <laughs> <laughs> No way! How could this happen? I don't know. I gave up writing her several months ago. So? Not answering? Why? You've got a crush on her. I don't know what to say to her. I'm not sure about my feelings anymore. I finally moved on. I'm at peace with it. Now she's back and caught me off guard. Maybe she wants to go out as friends. Maybe not. I struggle between what is right in my own mind and what is ethically and objectively good. Oh man, I'm saying a bunch of nonsense words. What on earth are you doing? <laughs> Give me that! Hey, I just want to help! Friday. It's in two days. I'm not ready. You're welcome. Have you lost your mind? Why'd you do it? I needed a while to think! I don't really get you. Why do guys on Earth make it so hard if you like someone? It isn't about Earth's guys. I like her, but I don't love her. Maybe it's because I've got someone else to think about. Just for that, no need to worry. It'll be just a friend thing. What's wrong with that? How many times did we go out or visit some dimension or do some stuff together? We're friends and it's never been a problem. By the way, you never asked me out visually. What, Star? What? Come with me, Marco! We have to think of your clothes! Wait, no need! I'm okay with my hoodie! Come on! It'll be fun! Trying clothes is not funny! Trial stylish swanky dress up! See? Not bad if I do say so myself. Are you kidding me? Do I look dressed for a friend thing? You really look like some kind of Prince of Muni. Prince? Do you prefer a princess? What? No, not again! Arr, pirate! No way. A spaceman! Star, I'm not having fun. Uh, Tom? What the? Listen, Star, it has to be something casual with her. Like watching a movie or eating ice cream. Not a party or a ball! Huh? Of course! I have the perfect suit for you! Blood Moon Ball Awesome Suit! When the light of the Blood Moon dropples down and selects two lucky souls, binding them together for eternity, and it's hypnotic, Ruby Broda. How do you know my name? I don't need a hero! I need a friend. So fascinating. At the Blood Moon Ball, I was enchanted by you looking like that. Enough! What is huh? wrong with you? What part of friend thing did you miss? And why do you do all these illusions? First you say one thing, and then another! Don't play with my emotions! Especially naming that darn ball! I hated it! Marco? Come on! Speak! What did you do to Marco? Are you controlling his mind? How many times do I have to say it, Star? I had nothing to do with this. Are you controlling Jackie's mind? What? What do you think I am? I've done some bad things in the past, sure, but don't blame me for your problems. What are you talking about? You saying this is my fault? As much as I hate the idea, it's pretty obvious what's going on here. His stupid face speaks for itself. Unbelievable. You still don't get it, do you? That idiot is in love with you. Did you never know or guess this? You don't have to believe me, Star, but I have no reason to lie to you. I can't force you to stay with me. I know. Your happiness comes first. Anyway, just for the record, you're too good for that insignificant human. He doesn't deserve you. Thanks. 
I really need to talk to Marco. <sighs> there you are. I've been looking for you everywhere. You mind if I sit down? Whatever. Look, Look I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. Oops, Oops, I cut I you off. off. You, you first. first. Okay, okay, stop, stop that. that. Hmm. Okay, I was an idiot. You were just trying to help. You couldn't have known what you said might hurt me. Don't stand up for me, Marco. It's my fault, too. I don't know why I said those things, and I'm sorry if they upset you. It's okay. I guess we all make mistakes, right? I went to the Blood Moon Ball on my own, and I ruined your night. I don't know why I did it either. Is that why you hate that night? N no it's because... No, never mind. Hey, just so you know, you didn't ruin anything that night. I was kind of hoping you'd get there. And now, I'm starting to wish I hadn't sent that text to Jackie. Especially if you had said you had a thing for someone else. What are you doing? Sorry, I didn't know what came over me. W wait, what's happening to your face? My, my face? Okay, that's weird. Okay, now you're scaring me. Gah! Marco, are you okay? Oh boy. I'm fine, I'm fine. B but what was that? What was that light? And what were you doing with the wand? What's going on, Star? Star? Don't worry, Mrs. Diaz. He could have pinched a nerve in his ankle when he fell. He just needs some ice and rest. He'll be fine in two or three days. Why were you on the roof? Usually you're more responsible. Um, my homework's flew out of the window, and I wanted to get it back. Well, I suggest you cancel all your plans for these two days. You need rest. I know, I know, already done, don't worry! Oh boy, did it really happen because... And now, I'm starting to wish I hadn't sent that text to Jackie. Mrs. Diaz, you don't have to be too hard on the boy. These things happen. He's young and healthy. He'll heal up like a charm. Thank you for your time, Doctor. Have a nice day! You too. Okay, I'm going to the kitchen to prepare a healthy snack that will help you get better sooner. Oh, there you are, Star. Perfect timing. I'll leave you to keep an eye on him, okay? Star! Where have you been? I haven't seen you since yesterday. I was worried. Don't be silly. You had to cancel your date with Jackie because you got hurt. And you still worry about me? It wasn't your fault, okay? Maybe you lost control of your wand, and you're probably going to kill me. <laughs> but I shouldn't do stupid things like that kiss. We're fine, that's all that counts, right? W wait, are you? I'm sorry, Marco. I don't know what's happening to me. Hey, hey, it's okay. Come here. Oh, wait, wait easy, don't! I said I hoped you didn't go out with Jackie, now it's all my fault! Or maybe Ludo's wand is controlling mine! I'm too dangerous! I should stay away from you! We're friends! You'll never hurt me. And if it will happen, I'll still never away from you. Trust me. Nothing in this world can get in the way of how much I love you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean how much I care for you! Marco! Oh man, I'm an idiot! I'm sorry if I embarrassed you. <laughs> Somebody's at the door. Do you hear it? You should open. I can't move. Whoa! What the? Star? You're not going to do this, right? Yeah. 
Hi, Jackie. I didn't expect to see you here. Oh my, I just prepared only two smoothies. Oh gosh, how was there an explosion here? Hmm. Was it me? No, I did it again! It's my fault! I can't believe it! I'm so embarrassed! Star, calm down. We're all fine. Here! <laughs> Hide it! Bury it! Make it disappear! Do something! Just don't let it touch me! I could kill someone! I told you! I can't control myself! I'm too dangerous! You're not! We just have to figure out what triggers this reaction! Come back! No! Please, everybody just stay away from me! Um, I guess this would be a bad time, right? I'm sorry what happened, Jackie. I don't know what's wrong with Star these days. I'm very worried about her. You're worrying for nothing, Marco. Girls can be unpredictable. It's just stress. She'll be quickly fine. Maybe you're right. I think she'll be fine. I'm not fine! I'm not fine at all! Oh! What's happening to me? Why am I acting so weird? I just want to know. See, Star? Things can always be easily taken. Reason and emotion always disagree. Sometimes you have to dig and find out what the inside of your mind is hiding from your heart. It isn't as weird as you might think. Your emotions are divided. You can control your feelings and use the one in the right way, or you can be overwhelmed by its power and lose control, thus using it in a bad way. Wait, are you telling me that I might lose control and become evil? Like Ludo? Mm. I'm afraid so, princess. Oh my god! My heart is black, I'm sure it's because of all those fights! Don't panic, Star. We all have our bad side. The solution is not to stifle it, but accept it and continue being yourself. But I don't know who I am anymore! You must understand and accept many things, Star Butterfly. You need to start from the beginning. My journal? What does that mean? I don't get it. You need to dig inside your feelings to take control of yourself. You have to know and accept the two parts of you. By reading my journal? By reinterpreting your journal. It will help you understand yourself and your thoughts on Marco. I know what my thoughts on Marco are. He's just my friend. Are you telling me that friends on Earth kiss on the lips? Okay, and all things with words of wisdom! Get out, get out, get out! Bye! <sighs> hmm. Okay, let's do this. I met Marco on the first day of school. Somehow the principal knew we'd be best friends, and it's true, we were. I like calling him the safe kid, even though he wants to look like a bad boy. He was suspicious of me at first, but in the end we became good friends. He also makes delicious nachos and invisible partners in battle. I think what I like most about him is that he helps with everything I do. And no matter how many crazy things I do, in whatever weird dimension I take him, how many monsters we fight? Marco is always there. He always makes everything better for me. He's my best friend. My mess up twin. My soulmate. I would do so many crazy things for him. And I know he would do the same. Oh, so sweet. I don't remember writing those things. It's all true. Marco has definitely changed my life, but everything changed after that kiss. Now I can't guarantee his safety if I don't find myself first. I need to dip inside my emotions. I can write my actual feelings. Maybe it'll help me find the truth. Let's see. His feelings for me are evolving. What about mine? I feel, um, I feel good when I'm with him. Oh, come on, Star, he kissed you. For some reason, my mind was hazy and my stomach just flipped. My chest felt like it was on fire. Today, we were about to kiss again, but I didn't try to stop it. Because... Oh my gosh! That can't be a good sign. Something must be wrong. Star must be agitated. The wand flipped out like this before. Maybe she needs to talk to someone. I can go and check on her. Who knows, I might be able to get her to open up. No, it's too dangerous. I'll go. <sighs> ouch, 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 my ankle! No, you definitely won't. I'll go. Jana, what are you doing here? Please. 
Oh, come on! And by the way, the door just blew up. The keys weren't necessary! What can I say? It's too funny. Star? It's me, and Jackie. Can we come in? Are you... here? Stay back! Leave... me... alone! Please! I can't hold her... for much longer! I don't want... to... hurt you! Her? Who? The green side! Green side? You mean, like your crazy wand right now? Uh, Jenna! Give me... my wand! Thankfully, the platter caught the round. It could be worse. Oh my gosh. He got burned. I hurt him. It's all, it's my, all fault. my fault. It's my fault. It's all my fault. It's all my fault. It's all my fault. It's my fault. It's all my fault. It's all my fault. It's all my fault. All my fault. All my fault. Are you okay? Does it hurt? Let me help you. Please don't! Just stay away from me! Wait, Star! I didn't mean it! Come back! Okay, so why is it so hard for you two to confess that you love each other? And then what? You just call your mom and left? Without explanation? There was nothing to explain. It was the right thing to do. Maybe. But that doesn't mean you're happier. You seem... broken. Are you sure you're okay? No. I've lost all certainty. <laughs> My dark side is making me do things that I don't want to do. <laughs> I'm going to end up like Eclipsa. I'm sorry, Bee Fly. I am not standing by. <gasps> Happy, Happy birthday, birthday Marco! Marco! We made a big cake for you. Do you like it? Come on, my son. <laughs> Say something. Oh, thanks. Look, sweetie. I know you miss her. We all do, but she's a princess. We all knew she would eventually leave. Not like that. I just can't help but think that she would have stayed more. If I wasn't... a huge jerk. My cake! Kate, why are you so hurt on yourself? We just want to see you happy. Sorry, I can't do it. But Marco... Thanks anyway. I have to go. No, wait! Please! You! I know everything. I'd slap you. If I had hands. I have hands, I slap myself, and it's not enough. If you came here to insult me, please, do your worst. Believe me, I would love to. But I'm not here for you. I'm here for Star. Is Star okay? Course not, turd! She's broken. Her heart, her feelings, her magic is dividing in half. Nobody knows what will happen if the two pieces break off. She could fall in the darkness. Or even worse, she could die. Unless someone saves her. What? I, I, I don't know. I'm not sure I'm the person she wants. Oh my gosh, Star. Someday you explain to me, what do you see in this dark? Come on, you idiot! Ah! Hostage taking! Kidnapping! It's alright, Star. Oh, please don't cry. You're a butterfly. You've got to be strong. It's not easy losing the people you love. It happened to me too. But I will take care of you. You're not going to be an evil princess, I promise. I know how it feels when you've found the dark power. The people you love get farther away from you. Because they're scared of you. Ludo! Did you miss me? Here. You won't find anything useful in there. It's not magic anymore. Oh, I know that, princess. I know. Your wand is broken too. 
Obviously, the two pieces were connected. And thanks to you and that stupid Marco, I have no magic! But hey, what's the good of magic when you can have the power of... A Dark Princess? If you think I'll let you use me for your evil plans, you're sadly mistaken. I'm still not dark, and even if I become that, I'll never, ever work with you! Oh, you poor fool. Who said anything about you helping me? Voluntarily. Ah! Here, you're welcome. Okay, that's new. Castle looks weirder than I remember it. Marco! Help! These voices. Queen Butterfly! King Butterfly! Oh no! Hang on, I'll get you out of there! Don't worry about us! Save her! Well, well, well. Here's the missing piece of the puzzle. I knew you'd surely come here. To her. Star! It's useless. She can't hear you. She's letting her evil side win. The princess is fading, and there's nothing you can do. Once her hearts are fully broken, she'll be gone forever. I'm gonna stop you! Easy there, Marco. You don't want to break the pieces. The magic is still there. And once the princess is dead, a new power will come into existence. And it will be all mine! No, Ludo. I'm not gonna let that happen. That's why I'm here. I'll never let you have her power. I will save her. Hey, Terry! I have something for you. Take it! Um, where do you find it? Does it matter? Let's talk more action. Bad move, Karate Boy. I'm going to... Don't even think about it. Unless you want any hole in your face. Star, it's me! Marco! I know you're still there! I'm not letting you go this time! Come on! You need to wake up and win against your dark side! I'm begging you! Please... Just stay away from me! No! Get off my back! Star, please don't! You brought me into this, and then you left! You were my touchstone! I thought you'd accept me no matter what, but you didn't! Nobody can fix me! How can I make things better? How can I be a good friend or a good princess? I don't even know who I am anymore! I do. You're a star butterfly. A weird princess. And a weird friend. Who always looks out for the people she loves. You're someone who's managed to change people's lives with her magic and cheeriness, especially mine. You brought me out of my shell and made me a better person than I could have otherwise been. Even when I accidentally hurt you, you were still there for me. You know, something I've learned these past few months is that anyone can have a dark side to them, a part of them that's more instinct and less logic. A part of them they can't admit having. And that causes nothing but pain and suffering. But you know what? It's okay. We were both afraid to face the reality of the situation. But I don't want to leave you all by yourself anymore. Maybe we'll never fully overcome our dark side. And that's alright. But we know who we are. And you. You are. All that matters to me. Yeah. No! Hooray! You did it! I'm still not sure about this kind of magic. You won't get away with this! It's over, Ludo! Oh my gosh! It's still green! My magic is still evil! I'm still broken! Star, calm down! I'm scared! Don't! You're not! <gasps> no, no, no! 
Don't you dare! It's never too late to save you. Please don't die. Star! She's alive! My little princess. M Marco! You... you saved me! I never thought that would work. I hoped it would. <laughs> Don't say anything else. Oh, Star! I was caught up in my magic troubles that I didn't understand why I was broken and lost. I was just missing a piece. You're that piece, Marco. No matter where we come from, no matter how much we're broken or lost, what does matter is to have family who loves you. This isn't fair. I worked very hard to own this power. Well, well, now that my wand's magic is back, I could stop you easily. I don't think so. This is our family heirloom, and we'll have it back. You should think about going back. To your family. All's well that ends well. Right? Come on, Marco. Don't be modest. You were amazing. I was wrong from the beginning. I needed a hero. And you were that guy. I don't know why it's taking me so long to realize. But with you, I don't want to hide my feelings anymore. I want to be just me with my flaws and virtues. Because I fell in love with a person who loved me because I'm me. Star! With that dress, you're more you. Yeah, I'm quite comfortable now that I can tell you what I want to say. I get it. And I say me too. Dad, do you mind? What? I hardly noticed you were there. Nishche. And the two pieces... ...are finally together. We'll <laughs>